Hey, hello, everybody. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Thank you for tuning in. Here's another check-in update in regards to uh, 880 Wilmington's uh, newest project, Operation Hope. My name is Tony. I am one of the organizers here for 880 Wilmington. And what we're trying to do is uh, raise awareness. Uh, we're trying to raise funds. We're trying to um, get donations donated so that way we can help the students at Feeding uh, Bedding High School. Uh, what it's all about is that we are starting a project called Operation Hope, which stands for Helping Our Pilots Excel. So as you guys have been following, so far we already have a subscriber, so thank you for subscribing to the YouTube channel. Anytime that we put on a U, uh, new YouTube um, video, or we are doing a video here on Facebook, you can go to our YouTube channel and you can see all the videos as many times as you want. So that way, in case you miss something that's valuable, or something that uh, you want to, to hear again or you want to share, you can go to the YouTube channel and you can go ahead and check it out. How are you doing, Frank and Science? Thank you for tuning in. So as I mentioned, uh, Sunday, uh, the donation box is at uh, Maya Restaurant on Avalon Boulevard, which is 401 North Avalon Boulevard. Uh, Cross Street is D Street, uh, where we always do our 8th annual, um, well, now it's going to be this year, it'll be the 9th annual, Thanksgiving Feast for the Needy, so that's where it's, that's been, always been held for the last eight years, and so right there is where we have our donation box, and thank you to my restaurant for giving a little bit of their real estate to have a box there, so that way you can drop off the kits, okay, so these are the kits that we're talking about, we're trying to raise awareness, and we're trying to raise, okay, um, and they're also similar products like this, so you could either use CVS, so you can see it's a CVS, you can use this brand, uh, Target has their brand, uh, Walgreens has their brand, Walmart has their brand, so they're all the generics, or you can use something similar to this. It's really important to bring in awareness of what we're trying to do here, because these are not just uh, normal occurrences that you would actually uh, see or hear or talk about. So as I've been, been you know, diligently uh, talking about is that there is a concern that we have going on at the school. Uh, there's lice going on, uh, and unfortunately, kids are no longer being sent home. So they have to sit at school uh, being exposed to a lice uh, that's being spread around at the school. So they're no longer being sent home. So, And then a lot of the students that we've dealt with, so far we already have two, and that's what these are going to be going to, uh, don't have a way to pay for it. So they're already living on a very, very skim budget or they're on some kind of social, uh, uh, social services uh, funding, or they're very limited on their income, they're single family, so they cannot afford what we take for granted for something that costs maybe $8 for this and then $10 for this. Um, to them, it's a lot. And so, as I mentioned in the other video, we already gave out two laundry cards that we're also bringing awareness to, uh, to help out for them, they don't have a way to do laundry. You can purchase a laundry card on Pacific Coast Highway next to the Chase Bank near Northgate and help out. So uh, these are the really biggest important things that we're doing right now, and we need to have this taken care of because it will not take care of itself. They don't have or won't go to a place because they're very humble, and the humility is, you know, they, they feel bad. They don't want to sit here and bring attention to themselves. So it's really, really important that we are trying to help them out. They trust us. The social worker works with us. So please share this information out. Please, it only takes a minute. You can get a couple of people together and buy a kit. You don't have to buy a lot. Just buy one kit, and it makes a big difference. So if you get two people to donate at least $5 a piece, you can buy one of these, or you can buy one that's generic. Or you can have three or four people and buy two of these kits. Or you can buy the comb. And what's neat about the comb is that, because I know some people are like, uh, shy away from the, the chemical of it, you get a kit like this, and it has you has everything you need, including the magnifying part of the back, to make sure you get everything. So you can either do the kit, or you can do the comb, or you can do the shampoo. This one happens to be a shampoo and the conditioner, so it's all in one with the comb. And then, of course, this is just the comb itself. 
So it's really, really important to please, 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 please share this out. Uh, as I mentioned, we have uh, also uh, a GoFundMe account, a PayPal, or if you go to my restaurant, there's envelopes there with a pen that you can write in and you can make your donation and drop it in the box, okay? So Rudy and Ricardo are kind enough, again, to let us have their real estate. To put a box there, you'll see a, uh, uh, a flyer on there letting you guys know it's all for Operation Hope. So please, please, please come forward and help us out as you did in the past for um, Operation Pilot Wheel and Adopt a Pilot. We are continuing doing events throughout the year, and this is something that we need to have this done and bring it to attention so that way we can take care of the students. All these things that we do all go into the event. We don't take a salary. We're all completely nonprofit. Hi, Gloria. Good morning. We don't take a, we don't take a salary. Everything that comes in comes back out. We do everything uh, right to the way it is, transparent. At the end of the event, we go over all the, the funding. Uh, we talk about how much is t taken in, and then we do the report, and then once that's done, we go on to another event, another event. So please, please, please share this out. It only takes a minute. Share the video on your Facebook page. Share it out with your family members. Share it with your friends. Even do this as an event as a co with your coworker. You know, just go ahead and say, hey, you know what? I'm part of a community that we are doing an important thing for the students. Their LA Unified School District is no longer sending the kids home. So it's really, really important that we address something and just not ignore it. So this is the reason why we are touching a subject that, of course, it is a sensitive in nature, but it is a, a concern that needs to be dealt with, and that's the reason why they trusted us to go ahead and do that. Good morning, Sandra. How are you? So it's really, really important that we do share this out. And as we also have a sponsor on our Facebook page, uh, it's called God with the Comb, that they offer a service that they can do a treatment for you uh, they come to you, and uh, they'll tell you all about. It. Of course, that's another alternative as far as uh, and as far as uh, light uh, hair treatment goes. So you can go ahead and, and uh, like her page, go ahead and share it out, uh, and that's another uh, option that you guys can do as well. So we have different different opportunities uh, that we're always constantly bringing. We are trying to go out there and let everybody know, so that way they're not just restricted to just one thing. We want everybody to be comfortable doing what they uh, what they do best. When they do uh, do give a love donation, it's something that you feel comfortable with, you're okay with, and so that's the reason why uh, we make sure that we're not just limiting to one way of doing something. We want everybody to be happy. We want everybody to be comfortable in doing this. So do the comb, do the kit, do the shampoo, conditioner. You can do the treatment. You can do it with uh, God with the comb. Those are the different things that we can do, but we have to take care of our students. So they have enough to, to worry about just being students, doing their schoolwork, attending school, and now they have to worry about this going on in their school. I was part of LA Unified School District when I was a kid, and I can remember when there was those kind of things going on, they sent you home. If you had a really bad cold, they sent you home. When you were, uh, you know, had a injury of some kind, you would go home. Thank you, Sandra. Totally appreciate that. Please subscribe to all our social media. Subscribe to the YouTube so that way you don't miss anything. I appreciate that. That means a lot to me. It means a lot to the organization of what we do. We are continuing to evolve. We are continuing to grow. We're right now doing a lot of grants to see if we can get more funding so that way we can get more things going and get more things done on our own. So we are taking our steps as much as quickly as we can. So I truly appreciate that. So as a matter of fact, today I'm going to a, a workshop for a grant to see if we can get some funding. So it's a substantial amount and, of course, due diligence and uh, paperwork dictates that we have to do all this stuff. So as a matter of fact, I'm going to, to one today. So I'm hopefully that will, will help out very, very much. So thank you for your kind work. So... That's what I'm at. See, that shows support right there. All you have to do is comment, like, share. So far, we're almost over 300 people on our Facebook page. It's totally awesome. We have over 700 views on our webpage. And, of course, we're on all social medias from anywhere from Instagram to Snapchat to uh, we have the GoFundMe, the PayPal, um, of course, Facebook. Welcome, David. Thank you for tuning in. We have Periscope. But right now we don't have an audience for Periscope, but we do subscribe to Periscope. 
uh, Twitter. So we're on all social media. So please, please, please follow us. Like I mentioned, we already have a subscriber. I appreciate it. So that way, anytime I upload a video, you're going to know what's going on. You won't miss anything. You don't have to go scroll down to the Facebook page to look for the videos. You can go to the video, recap what you want to see, get the information that you want there. Plus, I also put information on there. So what the video is about, if there's a location change, if you have any questions, you know where to go. So right now, this is the biggest thing that we're doing right now because this is something outside the normal doing something for the holidays. We want to do something all throughout the year. So this is just another event we're doing, which is, of course, Operation Hope, helping our pilots excel. It's all strictly for the students. We are working with a social worker. We're trying to help out. So if you know somebody uh, that could help out, as I mentioned, God with the Cold reached out to us. Hey, would you sit there and uh, like us to try to help? They have. So we put them on the on the Facebook. I'm going to add them to the website. It's another option if you want. If you have a concern that you know you have lice or whatever, and you want to have it private, they'll go to you. Of course. There's a price for that, so just go ahead and check it out. Thank you for the like. I totally appreciate that. Um, and that way, it's another way it's, it's completely private, okay? So um, check out their website. Check out the information. These are other alternatives that we can do. We'll do another video later on today uh, giving an update on the other stuff that we need, the toiletries and things like that, body soap. We also need all those, but right now we're concentrating on the life hair treatment because they need this like yesterday. So it's really, really important, and also the laundry cards. So we already gave those out. We need to get laundry cards so that way the students and their families don't have to worry about. Believe it or not, there's kids that go to school. They don't go to school with clean clothes. They don't. It's a very, very sensitive subject. So, again, another opportunity that they're giving us to see if we can help them on a one-to-one -one basis to reach out to them and say, what is going on? ¿Qué estás pasando? What is, what is occurring that this is happening? And a lot of it is because they don't have funding. They don't have a way. They don't have a car. They don't have a way to drive. They're limited to uh, their circumstance. You know, they can't leave somebody alone, so they can't leave. There's different, different factors. So it's really, really important to understand this is not just one of those nonprofits that we just don't do something and say, here, here it is to help you out some food from, you know, a food bank or whatever. I totally respect and great of all what they do. But we are taking this to another level of, of a status quo. We're not going to sit here and ignore these little things that are like hiding and not being brought out that needs attention. And they can't do it because one, there's no program or funding for it. Two, it's hard to talk about it. And three, you won't know about it unless they come out. And that's what they're doing. The students are actually coming to the social worker and discussing these things. So already at a young age, they're showing a lot of humility to say, you know what, I need help. So that way, when they get older, they can see that there's opportunities for them. And they're going to reach those goals. Because why? Because they don't have to worry about it, about a, a no or a door being closed for not an opportunity. So they're taking advantage of it. And that's the reason why we're doing that. So please make a monetary donation either by, again, GoFundMe or PayPal, or there's envelopes at uh, Maya restaurant. Go ahead and fill one out. Leave it there with Rudy and Ricardo. Let me know on, on Facebook, on Messenger. Uh, email me. Uh, and that way, I'll go ahead and let you know I got it. If you want to know by name, fine. If you want to be secret, that's okay too. But we just need to address this, okay? So we're going really officially into our second week of doing all this. So it's really, really important that we have an abundance of these kits. So that way, we can give to the kids. We want to have at least ten, at least ten kits. So right now, we're about three. And one sponsor who's offering their services, of course, there's a, there's a cost because stuff that you need to take care of it has a cost. But it's a service that's available. It's private. They come to you and also gives you the alternative of choices. So this is the reason why please reach, share this out. It doesn't hurt. Somebody can actually have a way of helping out. One way is sharing. The other uh, is either donate volunteer, and of course, invite. That's why we always have that mantra, invite, 
share, donate, and volunteer. There's always a way to do something. The more people that we reach out, the more people that we talk to, the more that we can get people involved, the more that somebody would want to help. So guess what? Somebody from just reaching out an olive branch after sharing, somebody talking about it, someone says there, hey, I can do this. I want to be involved. Well, guess what? We would have never gotten this far if it wasn't for everybody else. Okay? So there you go. So it's really, really important to please try to do that so that we can do that. Okay? All right. So that's the end right now. So I'm going to go ahead and leave you with that. Thank you for your time. I appreciate it. I hope we catch the views. We keep reaching them out. We're over 200 views when we put a video out there. So I know you guys are caring. So please help me out. Help the community out. Keep unity in our community. Cast a replay. And I'll see you the next time.